Welcome to our lecture online. Now let's expand it to something a little bit more challenging. So now what we're going to do is we're going to have six distinguishable particles placed in five different energy levels, N0 through N4, such that, and here's the five energy levels defined as the first one with zero quantum energies, the second one with one quantum energy, the third one with two quantum energies, the fourth one with three quantum energies, and the fifth energy level with four quantum energies. The constraint is that the total energy of all the particles combined have four quantum energies. So here's the table. Let's see in how many different ways we can arrange them. The different configurations, of course, will give us the number, the different number of quantum states, uh, not quantum states, but macro states. And then we're supposed to also find the total number of micro states. On top of that, we'll find the probability, the thermodynamic probability, and the thermodynamic probability normalized. So with a total of four quantum energies, if we place one particle in this level, then you cannot put a particle in any other level that has energy, so the remainder five particles must go here, which means zero here, zero here, and zero here. Notice that the total will add up to four quantum energies. So what is the number of microstates, well, that's our first microstate. We'll find out how many there are total. Notice I left some room to expand. But now we need to find the total number of microstates in this particular microstate. So for k equals 1, we have a total of 6 particles. So that's 6 factorial divided by, we have 1 factorial, 0 factorial, 0 factorial, 0 factorial, 5 factorial, so that's essentially equal to 6 over 5. Uh, let me take that back. That's, that's uh, no, not 6 over 5. 6 factorial, ah, let's just write it out. So 6 factorial, that would be uh, 4 factorial is 24, 5 factorial is uh, 120, 6 factorial is 720 divided by 120, essentially, so this is equal to 6. Again, a better way of doing it, you can simply say that's equal to 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 divided by 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. Notice this cancels out and we're left with 6. It's an easier way, of course, to calculate it. All right, that gives us 6 macrostates and so 6 probabilities. Now, we don't know yet what the normalized probability is because we have to add up, of course, all the probabilities first. All right. So notice there's only one configuration like that once you place one of the particles here. So now we're going to just put zero particles there and put one here. Now if we do that, notice we have different ways in which that can be uh, completed. Uh, well, maybe not. No, only one way. Because if we already have three quantum energies and we need to total up to four, that means you could only put one here. You must put zero there. And on the remainder, which is 4, come over here. Notice that this plus this combined gives us 4 quantum energies, so you cannot put, on, put any other particles in any energy level that has more than 0 quantum energies. All right, let's call that mic uh, microstate 2. Now let's find out how many microstates we have. So for k equals 2, that gives us 6 factorial divided by... 0 factorial, 1 factorial, 0 factorial, 1 factorial, 4 factorial. So the easy way to do that would be to 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 divided by 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. These cancel out. 5 times 6 is equal to 30, which means we have 30 microstates in the second macrostate. And so the probability or thermodynamic probability is 30 for that one. All right. What about the next level? So remember that if we put one there, there's only one other configuration we can have here. So what about zero, zero? Let's put one over here. Okay, if we put one there, and only one, to add up to four, that means we're going to have two over here and three over here. All right, we could also, of course, put two over there, but let's just start with one, so that's one configuration. That means that gives us the third Microstate. Let's find out the number of microstates. So for k equals 3, that gives us uh, 6 factorial divided by, and of course you could simplify it, you know, 1 factorial is simply 1. So you have 2 factorial, 3 factorial. So this is equal to, 
uh, 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 divided by 2 times 1 and 3 times 2 times 1. So this cancels out that. 2 and 4, the 4 becomes a 2 and the 2 becomes a 1. So you have 30 times 2 which is equal to 60. Just an easy way to do that. And that means we have 60 microstates for that microstate and a probability of course of 60. All right. Now, we said before that instead of putting 1 there, we could put 2 there. Put 0 there and 0 there, 2 there, but that adds up to a total of 4 quantum energies, because 2 times 2 is 4, that means 0 here and the remainder there. All right, so in that case, uh, let's see, that would be uh, macrostate number 4. And so for k equals 4, we have 6 factorial divided by uh, 2 and 4, so 2 factorial and 4 factorial, so that's equal to 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 divided by 2 times 1 and 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. These cancel out and then the 2 and the 6 becomes a 1 and a 3, that should be a 3. 3 times 5 is 15, that gives us 15 microstates in the fourth macrostate with a probability of 15. All right, is there any more combinations? Well, we exhausted putting either one or two in this energy level, so now we drop down to this energy level, and if we put zeros everywhere else, that means that we need to have four here with two remaining in the bottom energy level, because four times one gives us four, that seems like it's the last possibility or last configuration. So we have a total of five macrostates. And notice that we can tell that we have a two and a four and a four and a two, that we have again 15 microstates because we have the same calculation for k equals five. That means we have a probability of 15. If we add them up, that's 90 to 120, that's 126 total. 60, 90, 30, yep. Okay, and then if one have normalized probabilities, that would be 6 divided by 126. So 6 divided by 126, well, we just write the fraction down. 6 divided by 126, 30 divided by 126, 60 divided by 126, 15 divided by 126, and 15 divided by 126. So those are what we would call the normalized probabilities. Add them all up, you get 1. And those are the various ways, the various configurations, the various macrostates, five of them, with each the number of microstates calculated. And that is how it's done. I think that's right. <laughs>